self harm is not a boy kissing your scars and people feeling pity for you. In reality, you get looks of disgust and you are shunned. You would regret your scars. Sitting in your room at 4 a.m., blood everywhere, puking from blood loss and passing out. It isn't a pretty scene. The panic and numbness of the blade, you feel sick, not even in pain. The smell of blood is overwhelming. It isn't pretty. And I don't understand how people want that. Although I've noticed that a lot of people who do cut romanticize it and all the other types of self harm, such as burning, scraping, tearing, hitting, and more, none of them are pretty. None will get you attention. You are excluded from society and stared at. People ignore you. You automatically become the crazy person or emo. And now with depression and suicidal thoughts. Depression isn't crying into someone's arms and sitting in your bed looking cute and crying. Depression is a feeling of numbness. It gets rid of your motivation and energy. You may stop showering for weeks at a time or showering too much because you want to distract yourself from intrusive thoughts. It gives you no energy to brush your teeth, do your hair, and that usually ends in hating your body image. You lose interest in things you used to love, and you start to exclude yourself from other people, and then that ends with, well, no one cares about me. And you get even sadder. It's crying at night, a mess, and ex- intrusive thoughts running through your mind, telling you to do horrible things to yourself and others. The anger you feel of people abandoning you, even though you exclude yourself, and then you become suicidal. You become so numb, no feeling. All the numbness overwhelms you. There's no point in living anymore. I can't do this. You are so emotionally tired, you think the only way to escape the torture cycle is by destroying yourself. It seems like the only option. It isn't, though. It isn't pretty and isn't something to be sexualized and is usually, and it usually is lonely, not with someone hugging you while you cry. It is lonely and horrible. No light can be seen in this situation. It is not okay. This isn't a way to portray this at all.